Where you going? I'm leaving. You leaving me? What you mean you leaving me? Exactly what I said. I am leaving you. Why? You have the nerd ask me that question. Where you been at three or four or five o'clock in the morning? And then wake me up for church like we just this little happy-go couple. I'm sick of friend, Chris. Friend? What you mean friend? I work every day. Eight to five, just support this family. What do you expect? <laughs> I pay for your clothes, I get your hair done, and your nails. What do you expect? And you it just gonna pack up and leave? It takes more than that. Yes, I am gonna pack up and leave. Think I care about all that stuff? Huh? You think I care about the cars, the money? I don't care about any of that. You just don't get it. I don't get it. And you just gonna pack up and leave? Talk to me. Just talk I to me. I care about what you do. What's this? Divorce papers? You divorcing me? Let's talk about this. Chris, I'm tired. I'm tired. You're tired? tired. You're not gonna work on this. You divorcing me? After all this time invested? Talk to me. Yeah. Babe, talk to me. Going. Freeze. I don't know who you are, beloved. I don't know what you're going through. But there's one area that all of us have stayed awake at night, and that's in our relationships. Ain't it crazy how the one you love is never the one who really loves you back? Or the one you give your heart to is the one who always steps on it or throws it out? Beloved, we're going to do a series in the month of February entitled Love, Sex, and Relationships. Freedom from my past. I don't know who you are, but you need to send your ex a check that they left you early. That they left you before God blessed you with what he's about to give you. I don't know what you're going through, beloved, but we're about to tackle relationships as in how to date. Pastor Vernon did a lesson that blew my mind. He said there's no real chapter on dating, so he created the 10 rules of dating. We're about to dive deep into a relationship series like you've never seen before. I don't know who you are, beloved, but most of us are at an age now where we're tired of playing games. I'm tired of playing dating. I'm tired of playing house. I'm looking for something serious. Most men are looking for the woman who can complete them and push them to their destiny. And most women are tired of hearing I'm sorry. They're tired of hearing give me some time. They're looking for a right now man. A man who can come in and love them just the way they are. A man who can come in and love their kids. A man who can come in and be the priest in the house. I don't know who you are. If you're sitting at that computer, shout, I'm looking for a man. I'm looking for a man. Listen, you don't want to miss February. We're training godly men and godly women in the area of relationships. Every Sunday morning at 10 a.m., every Tuesday night at 7 p.m., you don't want to miss this series. Love, sex, and relationships. Before I go, I never forget looking at my girlfriend at the time. I looked at it and said, baby, the greatest enemy to our dream is reality because where we are looks nothing like where we're going. Grab your man, grab your woman, bring them to the Rock Church because your future looks a whole lot better than your present. Help me help you to help us. God created you just for me. I need you. We're healing relationships from the inside out. Don't miss it this February. Love, sex, and relationships. I'm looking for a godly man, a godly woman. I'll see you there.